So, here we are about to do our first wild camping experience. Camping in China is both legal and illegal. Uh, what that means is it's not really done by people very often apart from outside of the Great Wall. Or sorry, apart from, yeah, just at the Great Wall. Um, so, um, for foreigners, when coming to the country, you have to give an itinerary of all the hotels that you're staying at. So camping isn't really an option for foreigners coming in because the cops will move you along and when you get to a hotel you have to provide your passport and your visa stamp in your passport that shows uh, when you came into the country and when you're leaving. So they're very strict about the whole thing. So camping isn't really an option. If, a, if, a, if the police find you and they don't want you to be there then they can move you on. That's why it's illegal. But if you're out of the way like we are here uh, and you're not bothering anyone then theoretically no one should really mind. Um, the Chinese people that we've come across have been so friendly and welcoming that I can't imagine anyone would have a problem with it. But we might still get moved on from place to place. It's definitely an option. Anyway, this place is hidden behind a couple of sand dunes which I'll show you. You can see there it's builder sand that's just being stuck here. There's not even a road leading into this place, it's just like a little dirt track that leads down. So we should be safe enough. Mm -hmm. 